Many of the malware variants have been modified in such a way that they will redirect browser searches when searching for solutions to the malware problem that users are having and redirect them elsewhere. Uh, it makes it impossible for them to update their current security programs or download anti-malware solutions to clear the problem. Now what you can do is open up your C drive, open the Windows folder and scroll down to the System32. Open up the System32 folder and scroll down to the bottom. Now in here you should be looking for a folder or two folders, one called wdmod.sys and another one called sysaudio.sys. On wdmod if you right click it and select properties you'll find it's around about 24 kilobytes is the size on disk. If you click on the version it's Microsoft whereas the fake version will be about 14 kilobytes and it will not have the Microsoft name in there. The internal name is wdmod.drv and you will find with sysaudio in the same folder the same thing applies. If you have any other versions and they are not signed by Microsoft, delete them. They will only go to the recycle bin so it's quite safe to delete. Now then if you scroll back up and open up the drivers folder, again scroll to the bottom and find wdmod sys right click properties and again look at the version again this is Microsoft the internal name is wdmod and the original file name is wdmod.sys and you'll find the same with sysaudio if it exists in this folder which is where it should be that's if you have a sysaudio this doesn't apply to all machines if it's in any if it's in the system 32 folder then delete it if it's in the drivers folder that's where it should be so we we'll go back to system 32 and the malware will camouflage itself using a name like wd mode but it will not be Microsoft signed so you can safely delete it. All you have to do is right click, get the properties and look at the version and look at the file size because the fake ones that redirect you are usually around about 14 kilobytes so you can safely delete them, just get rid of them and look again for the sysaudio and this also applies to the config down add up worm which has caused a bit of havoc which you can find details on my blog about and another one is TDD SSERV which does pretty much the same and that can be removed with spyware doctor quite easily again you can find information about that on my now, if you want any more information Go to Free PC Security, which you can find at freepcsecurity.co.uk.